another short weekend and spend it here at um, Francis Slocum State Park again it's kind of the go-to place to camp this year and uh, this is the last weekend you could camp wound up here in the beginning of the year the first weekend you could camp so it's kind of nice to close it out here but I did happen to get my um, tie outs done on the tarp and got to use um, this new uh, grill well, I don't usually camp or I don't usually cook at camp but I use this as a light my fire grandpa's grill I think it's called we'll take a look at that in a minute but uh, let's take a look at the tie outs so before I came out I uh, fired up the sewing machine and put on some tie outs for the porch mode which I've been talking about doing all season and just never got around to doing it so I figured I'd do it now uh, and this just allows me to to raise up the front like this create some kind of wind protection so I did that on the, on one side and uh, just for this trip I wound up doing one in the back right here to help keep it pulled out now what I'll probably wind up doing is putting two more back here and one more on the other side and maybe a couple along this edge so that I can uh, do some different configurations with that tarp but it gives it a ton of room underneath there and up until now I've just been using those um, I think they're called tarp clips where they just kind of squeeze on there and hold it but they were starting to do some damage to the sill nylon so I figured it's time to add on the pullouts but I like it they held it really good and uh, give a ton of room like I said it didn't really rain there was no chance of rain last night but you may have heard in the background uh, pine cones and acorns and I mean it's fall so I would have woke up buried in leaves now, the other thing uh, that I use and I don't usually do I don't usually bring actual food with me I usually just bring uh, dehydrated meals but I decided to grab some hot dogs and hamburgers and use this little grill and uh, I'll try to do this with one hand so basically what you do is you just get any stick and the handle kind of grasps, grasps grasps around it and then there's this little latch here you open it up this will fit a hamburger patty perfectly you can put a couple hot dogs in there whatever I mean, you can get some bratwurst or even a small piece of chicken will fit in there and then you just take it and you hold it over the fire worked really really well really really well really really impressed with it I thought maybe the, the stick might burn but um, didn't have any problems yes that's by light my fire I don't think the names on it anywhere uh, yeah you can kind of see it right there and it's grandpa's grill nice it packs down really small and I think that all their containers they make those triangular containers I think this will fit in in those two it's the right shape for it so just getting ready to clean up uh, pack everything up and head back home um, last night no bug net needed I just had the hammock set up there's nice breeze blown through and uh, something ran through here maybe a deer or possum or skunk or something and then I think a an owl landed either up in a tree or caught a mouse or something because I heard a mouse or something squeaking out here and then uh, heard a soft thunk and a little bit of a screech it was very quiet though so um, it was pretty cool but that'll wrap it up here from Francis Slocum overnight camping trip nothing fancy thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one